All right, guys, it's Taylor with UH Productions. I'm here with Holly Mosher, the filmmaker who made The Banzai People. Really, really cool documentary. Just coming from a filmmaker standpoint, mm -hmm. what would you say was the biggest challenge? Well, this film was very challenging to do all around. First of all, with the culture, the women that I was filming were not used to speaking to any foreigners or anybody outside of their village. So at first they were very reserved and they wouldn't really open up to me. And I said, am I even gonna have a film? And then also the weather. I kept getting deterred when there were floods, cyclone happened, everything would get washed out. So they would say, oh, we're sorry, you're gonna have to come back in October because the roads are washed out. But that made me appreciate all that we have. Those people have to deal with that every day. So you mentioned the inequality between men and women. Yeah. How was it being a woman filmmaker? Well, I did like being an example of a working woman traveling alone. They'd ask me, like, where's your father? Because they couldn't imagine a single woman traveling without her father. The main theme from the film that I like really took to heart was taking disempowered people and empowering them. How do you see that we could apply that today? In, I mean, in our society, in our economy, well, actually, Grameen America is now functioning in the U.S., but what I'm actually more excited about is this idea of social business, which is their bottom line is to help people and solve a problem by creating business solutions that create employment. Like their bank employs 26,000 people. Their solar company has employed 12,000 people. Business solutions that are actually job creating and solving a problem. That is awesome. Okay, well, I believe that's all the time we have today. Um, yeah, I'm Taylor Hall. See you guys later.